Hello everyone, welcome back to another video from Somos Biology. And in this video lecture, we are going to talk about another mnemonic, another easy way to revise and remember gastrulation layers. There are three layers of gastrulation. At the end of the gastrulation, there is ectoderm, there is endoderm, there is mesoderm that is created. And these separate layers that are created after the gastrulation event, what these layers are going to capable of developing into means individual layers give a, give a rise to different systems in the body okay we need to find out these different systems by knowing these simple sentences that we have and we have two simple sentences for you one this image i purposely use this image i don't uh, want to offend anyone for any body shaming or any part but use this image to let you know every man eats and a person who eats is going to go for the food like this so every man eats and the second sentence is sense the red comb okay so a red colored comb, you know comb, all of us used it, right? So a red colored comb, sense the comb. So first is the every man eats and second is sense the red comb. Instead of comb, our word is come, Q-U-M-B, C-U-M-B, sorry, C-U-M-B, come. But come, comb is homophonic, so use this for that. Sense the red comb, and earlier is every man eats, okay? From these two sentences, we can not only understand the three layers, three germ layers but also we'll understand the different systems that are produced by these germ layers okay so starting with this e so i'll write it down e for ectoderm okay e for ectoderm then another e for endoderm and m is for mesoderm we have ectoderm, first E for ectoderm, second E for endoderm, and this M is for mesoderm. And we wrote it down. Ectoderm, endoderm, mesoderm. Okay. Now, afterwards, what else we need to know is this sense all are in capital, red all are in capital, come all are in capital. So, with ectoderm, we will go with this sense, S-E-N-S. -E in endoderm, we will go with red, R-E-D. And in mesoderm will go come C U M B. Okay. Sense is with ectoderm, red is with endoderm, and come is with mesoderm. Got it? You just need to arrange ectoderm, then endoderm, then mesoderm. Do not arrange ectoderm, mesoderm, endoderm here. Although mesoderm is in the middle layer, ectoderm is the outer layer, endoderm is the in inner layer. Remember that. Ecto means outer, endo means inner, and whatever it is in the middle is mesoderm. So, these words that we have, sense, red and come, they have different alphabets in it. And these alphabets dictate the different system generated or originated from these different layers of uh, the gastrulation. Sense, red and come. From these different layers, they are or originated. How they are originated, we are going to talk. So, for example, in ectoderm, we have sense. And here we have sensory systems. S for sensory system, EN, uh, NS for nervous system, E for eye. Okay, sensory system, I, nervous system, and this S is for skin. So from ectoderm, we get sensory system, nervous system, that is central nervous system, brain, and uh, the spinal cord. Then I is a part of the sensory organ. And we have skin all produced from ectoderm. Next, if you move to the next one, is red for the endoderm. R is for the respiratory system. E is for the endocrine system. Right? And D is the digestive system. So, endoderm generates respiratory system, endocrine system, digestive system. R-E-D red stands for respiratory, endocrine and digestive. And last we have come, C-U-M-B for mesoderm and C is for cardiovascular. Let me change the color. Cardiovascular system. U, urinogenital system. Let me write it here. Urogenital system. M for the muscle or muscular system. And B for the bones. So, for the mesoderm, we have cumb, cardiovascular system, urogenital system, muscle, 
or muscular system and bones. Muscle and bones are always produced from the mesoderm. Okay, and remember one thing: the notochord is actually originated from the mesoderm. There is the extra thing that is not written in here. But from these two sentences, we are successfully capable of telling the different system of the body are originated from which different germ layers. For ectoderm, sense, sensory system, nervous system, skin, endoderm, respiratory system, endocrine system, digestive system, the linings of the respiratory system and all. Come for the mesoderm, cardiovascular system, urinogenital system, muscular system and bones. So by knowing this every man eats and the red comb, we are able to successfully understand the gastrulation layers and the system that they originate within 7 minutes. That's the power of mnemonics. Incorporate mnemonics in your study. It will save a lot of time for information based questions, particularly for CSI and Net Life Science Part B questions. All the best. I believe this video helps you out understanding uh, the list, uh, understanding uh, this concept and remembering and revising the topic very fast just before the exam. These videos are going to be lifesaver just right before the exam. Revise with the help of this video and series of videos. Watch them in this channel. And if you like the video, please hit the like button, share this video with your friends and colleagues. Subscribe to this channel to get more videos like that in future. Thank you. Bye.